Now here's the best challenge of all. Let's go do it. Not always saying you go do it, you go do it, you change you change you go do it, here's the best challenge. Let's go do it, let's get healthy. Let's change the world. Let's build an enterprise. Let's work on this together. See I always respond to this lip. Sometimes it's hard to lift yourself out. It's hard to be self-inspired at first. And if somebody says, come on, let's start a new program. Come on, let's do exercises, come on, let's get healthy, come on, let's start something. I'll be there, you'll be there, you bring a guest and I'll bring a guest. Let's start something that is so inspiring to have somebody say let's let's do not always. You do. Let's do let's build a team, let's win the championship, let's walk off with the trophy. Let's wow. There's something about that that can keep you awake nights. There's something about that that turns on the juices. There's something about that that reaches deep in the soul for a person that can do extraordinary things. When somebody says let's let's I've got two with me already. If you will be the next one, we can conquer the world. You say together, nobody is a match for us by yourself, you're vulnerable with us. Nobody is a match. So figure out ways to say, let's. If you've got some differences with other leaders within the Urban Life Company, I would ask you to settle those differences in, in in the interest of future in the interest of doing the billions we want to do because when top leaders don't work together, I'm telling you it is incredibly costly to the whole company. When it's costly to the whole company, it's costly to each individual organization. But if we work together, all of that can be taken care of. Even if you've got some differences, find something you have in common and see if you can't work together while then you work on settling those differences. I'm asking all of you to follow that example and do the same thing. Not only work together with someone else but get other people to work together and then we can finish the job Mark gave us to do all those years ago had the president's team not responded a few years ago to Mark's call and work together on covering the world. Someone from Africa going to Europe, someone from Europe coming to America, someone from America going to Japan not working together is so costly. Not settling these little differences is so costly. I don't want these billions to be missing in the future. I want every billion I'm jealous about every billion in sales because of what it represents. So let's get it done and let's work together. Let me leave you now with this message. Three important words I want you to consider first is compassion. Mark's compassion to help people was unprecedented. He demonstrated it every day. He truly wanted to reach everybody and if it would have been at all possible for him to have reached everybody in person, he would have done that, he would have walked the streets, he would have covered the world and touched everybody individually if he possibly could have but he couldn't touch everybody individually by himself. He touched as many as he could sign as many autographs as he could, took as many pictures as he possibly could, flew as many miles as he could, did as many meetings as he possibly could, did as much training as he possibly could. Nobody did it better. And the reason is because he had this driving compassion that if he could reach somebody with the products, they would not suffer what he had seen other people suffer without the Herbal Life products. It was his compassion that caused him to reach out and touch the people and help them to get started. Even though they had not much to start with. That was compassion. I'm asking you to find it within yourself, a new 21st century compassion for yourself, so that you will be driven to reach the people. You will be driven to talk to the next person. You will be driven to help somebody change their life best you can. The next word I would ask you to consider is commitment. If all of us will commit to the dream. If we will commit to the opportunity. If we will commit to the chance to be the best in influencing our industry, the best in network marketing around the world. 
a commitment of developing leadership second to none of putting together a team that can finish the job over the next few years, committed to the next 20 years. If all of us will make that personal commitment, I'm telling you, the collective commitment will be unbeatable as we go now. Country after country with the 4950 we've already got using all of that information, all of that experience getting to the rest of the countries of the world with commitment. We can do that. The collective commitment will be awesome. Our total collective commitment can solve any problem, develop any product, go any place, reach any community, and touch anybody that needs to be touched with the urban life opportunity. There's nothing more powerful than collective commitment. I promise you mine. And if you will promise yours to me and I promise mine to you and we promise ours to Herbal Life and we promise that we will work together with each other. That commitment will help us finish the job. Subscribe share and like for more videos.